So number one goes down in week one of the college football season. And Florida State didn't even jump up in the rankings. That's crazy. This game is crazy. It made the schedule crazy. And you see it right there. I scheduled them with the plan to knock them off. And we came in the season as number four. And they already lost. I hate these bastards. I truly, truly hate these bastards. And then all the recruits that's ready to visit, the computer scheduled them to visit on the bye week. Welcome to Notre Dame Stadium. You walk in this place, you can feel the echo. So many epic moments have unfolded on this field. And today, the Fighting Irish hoping to reawaken that in this big contest. Today, it's a top 25 matchup. Two teams off to good starts, hoping to build on that and test themselves against another ranked team. As we'll see the number 15 team in the country, the Alabama Crimson Tide, taking on the third ranked team, the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, joined here in the booth by Kirk Street. Kirk, let's get to the action on the field. by the running back here. Just finding his lanes and exploding through the gap when it opened up. Notre Dame now operating in the red zone. Offense moving receivers around now before the snap. And looking to throw now on first down. Over the middle, it's calling. I really wanted to go to the tight end. Down to wrap up the first quarter of play. Getting set for the second quarter here, both offenses searching for a spark. They didn't do much in the first quarter at all. Damn, man. As we get lined up here for quarter number two, we'll see oh, if the fuck. Yeah, I got that play up on the screen. Didn't do much in the opening quarter. Ah, you fucking jerks. Here we go. First play of the quarter. Offense setting up for a second down play. On the run. It's low. Not much on that play. Brought down short. Crucial. Third down coming up in the red zone. Can he keep the drive going or will he have to settle for three? They'll try to run for the first down. Looks like Notre Dame will have the first down. Here's a great example of a back knowing where he needed to go on this play, and he didn't mess around. He got between the tackles and earned every single yard. The hell? I just bent back and the hell was that, bro? Well, they began with great field position, and that didn't take long at all, Kirk. Well, that's how you take advantage of an opportunity. Your defense sets you up in great field position. You're not looking for a field goal. You're looking for a touchdown. Give the credit to this offense for being aggressive and punching it in. <laughs> 49 didn't block a damn person. Damn freshman. It's going to limit your carries for the year. Why was he bending back like that? Here comes the Alabama offense onto the field. We'll see if this quarterback can shake off the interception he threw in the last possession. Going to run it. It's young. Just a small gain. Look at it. Second and nine. 
Well, another short game for this offense on the ground, and I got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They have really negated that aspect of this offense the entire first nah, half. Ah, caught the wrong shit. Them one dimensional, and if that doesn't no, oh, no, but it worked, baby. Off. Come on, St. Louis. Come on, St. Louis. Nothing seems to be going right. The defense is doing a good job of confusing the quarterback who's obviously throwing the ball into coverage. They've got to make some adjustments with their attack because right now it's not working. Ready. And the Fighting Irish offense comes back out onto the field. Can they keep it going? They mix the run and pass beautifully in the last Golly, touchdown. Yeah. No way to run up the middle. Chris, textbook job by the defense surrounding the runner and preventing that play from being bounced to the outside. Coming to the line on second down, this is important. They want to avoid a third and long. Quarterback adjusting now to the defense. He'll look to throw it here on second down. And he's got it. Touchdown, Fighting Irish. Well, perfectly thrown football here, and this quarterback's got to be fired up. That's his first passing touchdown of the season. Here's the first of hopefully many more for this young man. Go, Irish. I don't know what the hell six did right there. I threw that slightly late. I had a one was waiting for zero to move. About time this offense gets going. It's a first and ten. DB's looking to jam the receivers at the snap. Oh, the tackle is made, but there's a flag on the field. Let's see what that's about. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Offense moving backwards after that holding penalty. This Alabama offense is moving quickly down the field. What the hell going the on right there? He's looking to throw. Fires it to the wideout. And this is dropped. Come on, y'all. Keep your head on the switch. Game, but he could not collect it. The completion sets up a second down. Linebacker's trying to confuse this offense now. Looking for some space. It's Haynes. It's a nice wrap up there by the junior. You know, in the era that we live in right now, everybody wants to spread the field around, try to create space, try to create one on one matchups, and the defense is countered over the years by trying to play out wide. But here's a great example of a defense has the yeah. senior getting home with the sack. Yeah. The defense does their job on third down and long. They get after that quarterback, and now it's fourth and forever. Coverage did its part. Let's not forget about that. Buying the pass rush enough time to get after the quarterback. See, I took the penalty yardage because I trusted in my defense with the cover. Looking to throw it on first down. Makes a quick catch. He makes the stop, but not before a solid game that time. First down play call. How aggressive will it be? Ain't playing no man defense. Offense looking to throw the ball. Let's it fly out of the wide out. Pass caught. Can he get in? He'll be stopped short a couple yards from the goal line. And I forgot to do it. You know who's got to love this offense picking up so many first downs? Their own defense. And when I played, I used to have defensive guys come down and tell me when we'd have a long drive, how much it would allow them to rest and go out and play dominant football. Ready? 
Notre Dame lining up now for a first and goal. Try to muscle toward the end zone on the ground. Couldn't quite get there, but brought down at the one yard line. Trying to kill clock anyway. Coming up, second down and goal. On the ground, trying to power toward the goal line. And they try the middle, but stuck for no gain. So the offense takes the field in the final seconds of the half. Chance for just a couple more plays. Timeout is called to talk strategy. Time for just one or two plays here before halftime. One more play before they head to the locker room. And they're trying to punch it in here. And now the defense able to bring him down. And the offense will now quickly spend a timeout. Hell no. And it's likely they'll take one last shot here before halftime. Moves. He ain't helping. <laughs> we won't get him out of the way because he ain't helping nothing with the blocking. On the ground, trying to punch it in for the score. And he runs it into the end zone. Touchdown, Irish. That's playing to the echo of the whistle here in this first half. They just keep pouring it on. Why not just continue to be aggressive? It's worked out so far for them. What a big lead they've worked up now here in this first half. Acorn. Moving the receiver around pre-snap. Here comes a first down pass attempt. Receiver looks it in. It's complete. They make the tackle, but not before a solid gain on that pass. Pass complete. It's second down now. Quarterback drops back. We're going to test the secondary. He's got it. Tackled at the five-yard line. Now it's first and goal right there. I just continue to be in awe of this offense. Even with the lead, these guys are going to play for 60 minutes. They do not let up. Here they are. Typically, you want to run the football here to work the clock, but these guys stick to the game plan and keep throwing the football, trying to get more yards. Tuna, tuna. And the quarterback dropping back. Ah. This is incomplete. He dropped the first hand attempt here across the middle. Chris, I thought he had his hands on that football. I thought he was going to come down with it. But give the defense all the credit when a big hit to knock that ball loose. Been a decent gain there before the defense brings him down. On the ready. Any port, third down and goal now. Keep it on the ground, trying to power in for the touchdown. Touchdown, Notre Dame. And this one is getting ugly. Well, the whole squad already was ugly. So, I mean, hey. And get eyes into that backfield. He may go for a third or a fourth later today. We're going to lose three running backs off this roster. Because if he has a, a better productive game than today's game, that's why I'm actually playing double running backs. <laughs> I'm having them sub a lot <laughs> to keep his stats down. <laughs> First play of the drive, they come out throwing, bringing pressure. That ball's incomplete, an aggressive deep shot on first down. So second and 10 after the previous play. Secondary backed up off the ball now. Dropping back. It's Simpson. 
Yeah, bitch. Comes out. A disastrous play from the start. The defense recovers the fumble. Just a great job by this defense to knock that ball loose. You get a critical turnover here late in the game, working with the lead. You get the ball back to your offense, and now a chance to secure victory. There you go. Harness chase right to me. See if they can punch it in. It's first and goal. Quarterback pre-snap adjustments now for this defense. And the tight end goes in motion before the snap. Go, go. Dino, Dino. Quarterback looking to connect with the receiver here. Touchdown, Fighting Irish. Stretching the lead. This one is getting ugly. I don't know what happened right there. Damn, man, two interceptions, man. Alabama getting set with a first and ten now. Off the play fake, looking to throw. The pocket breaking down. Got him for a sack. A big play made them one of the senior leaders of this defense. Yeah, my D tackle. takes the wind right out of your sails. This offense is trying to find a way to get back into this game. And another pressure and a sack against their quarterback. I think I called him Harness earlier. Hemish. My bad. After a first down loss, it's second and long from their 25. From the shotgun, drops back looking for an open man. It's a short completion to the big tight end. And the broken tackle there produces a solid game. And that's the two-minute warning here. This offense desperate to cut into this lead and then try to get the football back. Drops back looking to throw for it on third down. Got him. He's sacked. It is a sack party out there for this <laughs> offense. Squad. You know that this offense is going to try to throw the football. Dun, 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 dun. Pre snap motion from the receiver. And looking to throw now on first down. Damn it. And that's incomplete. Just eight seconds remaining now. Well, this is textbook defensive back play right here. He's in phase with the wide receiver. And the thing that I love, and a lot of defensive backs don't have the ability to do, he gets his head turned around, eyes on the quarterback, to know when the ball's coming to allow him to knock it away. Squirrel, <laughs> Send them all deep. Let me see him on the post. Second down, we're going to throw it. Caught near the goal line. Touchdown, Irish. And the beatdown continues. So much about speculation on whether or not they're going to kick a field goal or go for a touchdown. They put this ball into the end zone, and they put this game out of reach. What a job by this team and by this offense. He a sidearm throwing quarterback. He a baseball player. as good as they build on this big lead. Kickoff team is on the field to boot this one away. Sorry, boy, make sure it don't glitch. He'll return Three, from inside two, the five. One. Game the returner over. is brought down as the clock expires. That will wrap up this football game.
Yeah, so y'all suck. Being a blowout, Kirk, they get the W. Hey. They also make a pretty strong statement. At least y'all lost yeah, on the road to a top at least three team. Than how things ended up, but give credit to so, this team for coming out with a good game plan and just dominating the game. All out the top game. 25, probably. And that is going to wrap it up. We enjoyed this one here. For Kirk Herb Street, I'm Chris Fowler, and this has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football. I know I would have caught a timeout if he didn't score on that one. <laughs> All right, let's check the stats. Over 20 first downs, we'll take it. Defense did so good that we didn't have a lot of total yards of offense. Also, the running game could not get past them. Look, they had more yards per rush than we did. We also had them sacks, though. We got sacked. So, uh, out through their quarterback. Had more attempts and doubled his completions. 242 passing yards. And three for seven on third down. We don't like that, though. Uh, red zone, you know, because we had that turnover. All right. Let's see, we only got plus one on that category. Turnovers make all the difference in the game. I mean, not really this game. We still whoop their ass, but <laughs> you need to get the turnovers. All right. So we even outpunted them. No penalties. Clean game for us. So 19 for 27, 188, two touchdowns. You see, he's only an A3 overall. So, you know, he ain't going pro. Might be our starting quarterback next year. Look at that, man. He ain't never had no stat that low. At least we got you in the end zone, senior. He ain't going to stay. He got he 97. He going pro, man. Uh, <laughs> hey, we spread the ball around. Moss out here. Damn, he only 168 pounds. Six catches, 49 yards. Love had four for 28. Pauling had three for 37. Tight end, senior, got him in the end zone. Gray House had two catches for 30. Faison had a catch for 30 and a touchdown. Flanagan, backup tight end, got him a catch. Stevens, somebody on the depth chart. <laughs> I don't like all these dudes is 82s, man. What are we? damn 1990s goddamn me NFL Price even had a catch I know we gave us some sacks oh they ain't even counting nothing sacks against me okay cool shout out to my team y'all didn't get the sacks counting against y'all damn freshman you wasn't blocking a damn thing how do you get two pancakes who, who did, when did you block somebody alright Hennish, two and a half sacks, four tackles for loss. That's seeing leader. Mickey, he ain't supposed to even be on the team anymore. But, you know, the game, I had to keep playing, man. Uh, Burnham. I moved him from defensive end. Maybe I should have kept him at defensive end and then just played him at linebacker. Sneed moved over to middle linebacker. Yeah, my oos right here. Got the interception. I'm not even sure who the hell is. That's transfer. I didn't do the recruiting. It might be like a transfer. That's probably where these other guys got their damn dirty number from being transfers. All right, y'all. So stay smart. Stay safe. Hey, St. Louis. He had an interception. We got more to come. It's the 2025 Notre Dame fighting Irish put us in the conference this time. So we shouldn't have that nonsense that happened in the first season. Remix. Yoakum doing all of our kicking. I probably should have red shirted Payne. 
Oh, well, too late now. Hey, hey! Forgot he he should have had a forced fumble too, didn't he? 